It's a good day in Arthur. Brought to you by Best Western Plus Hotel and Convention Center of Arcola. We continue our fabulous week in Arthur, Illinois, at a place where entertainment is on stage, literally. We are here at Penn Station. Th thanks for, first of all, bringing us here. Oh, yes. We have had a great couple of weeks of just learning so much about all the things there are to do in this area. Let's talk about this particular location, Penn Station. How did this get here? And give me a little history. Well, you know, Penn Station has really been known for Wednesday nights. They have a group that comes in. It's Gunny Sack Review. So there's like a little blue group that happens on Wednesday nights and we used to operate the theater out of Arcola which you guys have been there you have mm -hmm. seen a lot of the things at the Best Western and so when COVID happened we shut down the theater and there was just a transition what are we gonna do do we open it back up and then we thought what about Penn Station this was the perfect location we're right here in the heart of Amish country of Illinois and you already have tourists and bus groups and families that are coming to this area anyway and so to be able to say let's add something else to Penn Station so Thursday Friday Saturday Day, then we have musicals here and right now we're running the legend of Noah's Ark. I love that you all do this and you're right it brings people in and gives them more options for that weekend stay to find great entertainment. This theater is a little different perhaps than most with the musical theater that gives a longer run right? Yes exactly so most of the time you see different shows that have maybe a two-week run that are in the area but ours is longer and the goal for that is to allow people that are a little bit ways away so especially Wabash Valley and beyond to say how do we plan our stay and how do we get the most bang for our buck and see all the things that we want to see so a lot of people come they come to the theater they come to see the musical but then of course they're hungry so <laughs> where do they have to go they have to go to Yoder's you know <laughs> and so everybody is going to the different locations from the restaurants to the shops everyone loves to go to Shady Crest or they love to go downtown and see all the different shops I mean it's all of those pieces that really make I think our area the surrounding communities really Really tied together that a person can come they stay at the Best Western and there's so much to do every single day we've enjoyed seeing it all during our tour but right now I'd like for you just to see a little piece of what is Noah's Ark the musical mystery we've got a couple of the actors with us today Trenton Camillo thanks for talking to us today so let me all first of all ask who do each of you play in the musical well I play detective Dodd so the concept of this musical is that there's some flamingo salt and pepper shakers that have gone missing from an important person in the town. And so my job is to locate them and figure out what's going on. And I have a special suspect in mind that I'm following. <laughs> that must be you. That's me. Yeah, I play Noah Zark, uh, the namesake of the show. And he's, uh, he's a former farmer turned antique store owner. Uh, kind of a bumbling businessman, doesn't quite understand what's going on yet, uh, but he has a prize collection of antique animal salt and pepper shakers, and that's what makes him the suspect for the flamingo crime. It sounds like he's a big time suspect. <laughs> yeah. Both of you have had the opportunity to do theater in this area. This isn't your first stop in this region, right? I have uh, worked in a venue in Sugar Creek, Ohio, which is very similar to this, this kind of area in Amish country. And so I'm really excited that we're able to continue that kind of legacy and bring it to here in Arthur as well. Yeah, how about you? Yeah, I've been all over different Amish communities. I started out in Shipshawana, Indiana with Blue Gate musicals. And it's really great to bring that type of kind of family friendly show to Arthur. I'm more excited. Yeah, this is an amazing place. So congratulations to both of you. Could you perform for us today? Yeah. Yeah, what to. will you be performing? This song is called Honey Honey. Mm, honey Honey it is. Thanks, guys. Honey, honey, you'll never guess what happened. They gathered all the facts and then devised a plan. Honey, money, there's more than you'd imagine. We set a little trap and then we found our man. It's kind of like a card game when you're looking for the joker or praying for the river in a heated game of poker or stamping the last number in a steamy game of bingo. We searched for all the clues and then we captured the flamingo. Funny, funny, the widow was ecstatic, and sixty thousand dollars was easy to afford. Honey, honey, you'll never guess what happened. We paid off all our lenders with her sweet reward. Honey, honey, you'll never guess what happened. Money, money, there's more than you'd imagine. Funny, funny, the widow was ecstatic. We captured the flamingos, and the ending was dramatic. Oh, honey.
me, honey, you'll never guess what happened. And the legend of Noah's Ark can be found on third or can be seen rather on Thursdays, Fridays, and Saturdays. Now through October 28th at Penn Station. Of course, that's over in Arthur, Illinois. The website for tickets and more information is PennStationArthur.com. Well, coming up next, if you are a fan of Denzel Washington, the Equalizer franchise, we'll take a look at